So today I'm going to be making some coasters and I'm going to be throwing them on a wheel using about 200 grams of clay and they're going to be like a medium size about this big and after that I'm going to be using my silk screen to put a nautical compass design on them. So right now I'm going to get started throwing. I have 10 pieces of clay so I'm hoping to make about 8 or 9 complete coasters. I've just wrapped them up so they don't dry out and this is the one that I'm going to start working on right now. I have my silk screen medium and some black slip that I'm going to use and I'll show you the process of how I use the silk screen medium and the slip to make a little design. So right now I'm just going to mix up a little bit of this um, silk screen medium and slip to make my mixture for the silk screen. About that much slip. Just a tiny bit of this silk screen medium. Then I'm gonna let that sit for a couple of seconds. Then I'm gonna go ahead and mix it around. The, the consistency you're looking for is uh, kind of like a peanut butter consistency, so pretty thick. So now that this is pretty smooth, I'm going to take my silk screen, which is just like a little, looks like a little piece of plastic, and I'm going to place it down where I want it, right in the middle of my um, coaster. And I'm just going to use my finger to dab the silk screen medium and slip on there. I'm just going to use my needle tool to gently lift up the edge of this. And there we have our design. Turned out pretty nice. <laughs> Fortunately it's not exactly in the middle, but it's pretty much in the center. Now that that one's done, I'm going to go ahead and do a couple more on camera for you, and then I will do the rest. So here are all my finished coasters. I did my little silk screen design on all of them. And they all turned out pretty well. Um, a couple of them turned out a little bit uneven, but other than that, all the designs came out nice and crisp. So I'm really happy with that. So now I'm going to let these dry, and then I'll bisque fire them and be back to glaze them. So all my coasters are fired. As you can see, the design showed up pretty well, and a couple of them warped. This one warped a little bit. Um, this one's going in the shattering pile because it's warped. The rest of these, I'm going to paint some clear glaze on them. All I'm doing is just dipping the brush and just brushing it on and I'm going to just do it to the edges so it doesn't get on the bottom and stick to the kiln shelf. So now that these are all glazed, I'm going to go ahead and fire them and we'll see how the set turns out. This is how they turned out. The silk screen design turned out really nice and clear on the majority of them. A couple of them, let's see, it turned out a little bit lighter, but I think they all turned out really nice. Um, we did have a couple failures. Um, I think two of them buckled, so they, they bent a little bit so they don't lay flat, so they're not really usable. But all the rest of these, um, I think we're going to turn out with eight in all that turned out good. So. 
this was definitely successful. Uh, like and comment if you would use a coaster that looked like this, and don't forget to subscribe.